what we do here is go back, 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 back. I don't know why I always say hi vlog. It's, I guess it's kind of like when you say dear diary when you're writing in a diary. So today I will be doing a shoe haul and glasses haul. These are new, if you haven't noticed. These are some fabulous cat eyes from Zenny Optical. And I'm gonna try not to look at myself on my screen like I am right now because I know I'm supposed to make eye contact with new people. Um, new people, that's rude, that's rude. I have 10 new pairs of shoes here. I didn't get them all at once, they're from different places. I got three pairs from Famous Footwear and then uh, six pairs from DSW and then one pair is from Poshmark and they're quite the find, but I'm gonna show you my other glasses first. So I have these cat eyes. I feel like they make me look like my Aunt Joyce when I wear them, so. I remember seeing pictures of her in like her high school and middle school school pictures and she's in her little cat eyes. She just looks so cute. Now I have a pair. And then I also got dun 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 Very round Harry Potter glasses. I have to be honest, I've always wanted a pair of Harry Potter glasses. I know mine aren't gold like his, but I really like round black ones. I wish they didn't have purple along the side, but I guess, you know, it's festive. And I got these, which I really like them. They're like a slight cat eye, but still kind of square, so they're very professional looking. I feel like I look very professional now. On to the shoes. Oh, I almost forgot. I also ordered these back in um, uh, September at Regionals. I really wanted a nice pair of gloves to, not like warm gloves, they're more like dressy gloves, but I got them from Del Arbor. I'm actually going to link their website below. They make custom skating dresses and they also have ready to wear skating dresses and now they make gloves and bodysuits. I've always wanted a nice pair of black gloves to wear. I have to admit, I'm half tempted to glue fake nails on them like drag queens do because amazing. They actually outline your hand kind of like when you draw a turkey for Thanksgiving. And they're like, your wrist is really tiny. I'm like, I know, I know. But every time I try to buy gloves, they're just way too big on me. They're like too short in the fingers, but they're too big everywhere else. Oh my gosh, you guys. Oh my gosh. Oh, yes. Ooh. I'm going to take the shoes out, show them to you up close, and then I'm going to try them on. And I'll have to admit, I'm wearing festive Christmas socks, and I'm not taking them off. You're going to have to deal with that. They will not match all of the shoes I bought, but it's the holiday season, so deal with it. But the first pair of shoes I have got in my clutches are a pair of Jeffrey Campbell's. Now, I love Jeffrey Campbell's shoes. In case you're wondering, what Jeffrey Campbell shoes are. They're the shoes that Lady Gaga enjoys quite a lot. The ones that have like the heel cut out, which you will see in like 10 seconds. Just hold your horses. But yes, I already have a pair of those and without the heel and I have another pair that are really high and I love them. Like I love them. And people are always like, oh my God, how do you walk on those shoes? I'm just like, I don't know, I defy physics, I'm actually an alien, I'm not from this planet, and gravity doesn't affect me. Unless I'm skating, then I fall on my butt. But yes, time to unbox the shoes. Super cute box, I will probably keep it, although I try not to keep boxes. And I love when shoes come in these bags like this, because it's great for packing. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I am looking at because do you guys see this? <gasps> Ooh, look at that heel. Yes. Okay. So what we're looking at is a regular leather shoe with a superstar heel and the cutout, a Mary Jane style with this little strap, and they have a lot of cushion inside. I love them. Oh, they look like a shoe. Hello. Bye now. On to the next pair. So this box is completely ripped off, but I don't care. They have rose gold. Let me put them this way. So pretty and little specks on the heel. Pretty. 
that are so comfortable and these actually fit my insoles, which is great. This pair is Dirty Laundry brand. Now, these are like those Balenciagas, the one that looks like socks, the knockoff version. And I just really, really wanted a pair. Um, they're comfy. They're socks with soles. Next. This brand, Indigo. I really love their shoes that fit my feet really well. This is every six-year-old girl's dream at Christmas and Easter time. Probably Hanukkah too, don't want to leave that out. All the, all the religions when they have festivities. When you were six years old and you were born in the 90s, you wore these. Let's be real, we wore glitter. We wore glitter, only these are cute with the double Mary Jane strap. I adore them. Mix number six. I also really like this brand. They fit my feet very well. Sorry for all the crumbling. They're super uber Mary Janes. I just think they're so cute and dorky and they suit me, I'd say. Sam Edelman. I got these. A nice little gold heel, a nice little gold number. Very good to have on hand when I'm doing modeling shows because Sometimes they want a more metallic heel when you're wearing more formal wear, but I wear a seven and a half in their shoes. I have, I'm five foot ten, but I have a size seven and a half foot, which is small for the average population, let alone all the women who are five foot ten usually wear a size nine. So I have little hooves, like a little man or a little goat. More like a little goat that screams. On to the next pair. Impo? Impo. 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 They're just a simple boot, which I feel like in the 40s it wouldn't be this high of a heel, but the buttons, the, see the buttons, oh, they're just so classic and I'll probably be getting rid of all my other black suede boots and replacing it with this. I like that it has a platform, I like how grippy it is, I don't know if you can see that. Yes, I'm living for these. Another pair of Pumas! They're so pretty! Ooh. Yes! Yes, I got these because I know that my insoles will fit in them, and I have a pair of burgundy shoes that I love a lot, but my insoles don't fit in them, so when my feet really started to bother me, I feel like I couldn't wear them anymore. I need the extra supports. Rika! This is another brand. They're, they fit very similarly to Puma's, only they have a little extra arch support in them. I got these. Could be sold. But I like that these are high-rise because in the winter, I still have to wear sneakers to the rink. Um, but it's nice to have something a little higher so it, you know, supports my fluffy socks and keeps my feet a little warm. Err. On to the last pair. Lugs! I've actually never worn lugs before, so this is actually kind of me going out on the limb. I knew that my insoles would fit in them because boots tend to have a little more room. Look at them. They're so cute. Oh my gosh, look at them. I just like the gray fur. Oh, there's the little lugs detail. They're basically knockoff Timberlands, but the Timberlands don't... I haven't found a pair of Timberlands in this color. But yes, I'm going to close the vlog now. Let me know your favorite place to buy shoes, or which pair was your favorite that I tried on. And I will see you in the next video where I will be chopping off eight to nine inches of my hair. Okay, bye!